Hello everyone, welcome to Excel 10 tutorial. In this advanced Excel tutorial, I'm going to show you how you can track changes in Microsoft Excel without sharing the workbook. Okay, in a previous tutorial, I have showed you how you can add track changes option in Microsoft Excel. It's hidden right now for a newer version, but you can add it in your quick access toolbar like here. I have showed that in a previous video, please check that out. But there is a problem if I use that track changes, you can see track changes while editing. This also shares your work. So the problem is that if you use the built-in track changes function in Microsoft Excel, you will have to share your workbook. Okay, but now I want to track changes, but I don't want the workbook to be shared. Okay, let's get started. <laughs> Now, before starting, I would like to thank Lillian Acosta for becoming a patron of this channel. Okay. Thanks a million Lillian for the support. It means a lot to me. Thank you very much. Now, we are going to use Visual Basic for application for this tutorial. So, we are going to write the code. And if we right click here on the sheet tab, remember, I want to track changes in this worksheet. That's why I am pasting the code here. Okay. Right click here, click on view code and then write the code. I have already written the code and now in here you can see at the first line we have a1 to z1000 this is the data range where i'm going to track changes okay if you need to change the data range you can change it from here and you can close it okay so our code is there and it's already written if you need the code please sign up the form and subscribe to the channel okay so let's test it if i write here and press enter you can see this red icon we have a comment icon here if i hover here you can see the changes has been tracked here the edit and then the date time and by whom that means the author name and the previous text if i have any previous text it would be here okay so let's write another thing here press enter and if you hover here you can see the first changes has been moved down and the latest changes are at the top of this comment box okay so again we have our date time and the author name and then we have the previous text which was edited by me and what was the previous text but if you track changes you don't have the previous text all the time but in this way you can track all the changes let's change it again here press enter and you can see the changes has been edited that means you can track all the changes that has happened to this cells okay so it's efficient than our traditional track changes also you don't have to share the workbook with anyone okay so this is what i wanted to show you thank you thanks for watching see you in the next tutorial don't forget to subscribe and lillian thank you very much for the support and if you guys want to support the channel like lillian please check out our patreon page here and remember if you need the code you will have to subscribe to the channel and then sign up to the form okay so please subscribe to the channel and see you in the next tutorial thank you thanks for watching